Hey, welcome back. It's your boy, Ryan. Another episode of The Wine Guy. Today, I'm going to be doing a, my first review of a bottle of wine that I know from the get-go what it is. That I picked Kendall Jackson Vintners Reserve Merlot 2017. So Kendall Jackson's very big brand. You can pretty much find this in any grocery store, convenience store, almost. So we're going to see what it tastes like. Again, it's a Merlot 2017. It says elegant aromas. So I'll be the judge of that. I've already poured myself a glass, by the way. So here we go. Very clear. No gas, no sediment. Smells nice, pretty soft. Nothing too much stands out there. Get a, get these aromas. Smell that bouquet. Okay, picking up some, some black fruits. That'd be like plum. Black cherry maybe? Black cherry, oh definitely black cherry. Some red fruit maybe. Not too much though, less so. Smells like this has definitely seen some oak. Oak barrels, that is. Well, all right, let's give it, let's give it a taste. See if I can confirm any suspicions. Okay, yeah, definitely. Ooh, definitely dry wine, not sweet at all. I don't know, definitely like getting a lot of the black, dark fruit. Like, I like the plum. Oh, it's a pretty good, pretty good bite. Decent tannin, not nothing crazy. Maybe medium tannin. Pretty full body. Well, that's a full body, if you know what I mean. But yeah, I, mean, I definitely would be good with some, with some, probably some grilled meats, but like a steak. Hmm, very dry. Sydney's pretty low. Honestly, not bad. I think I spent like $12 on this. But for a $12 bottle of wine, that's mass produced. So far, not so bad. Let's see what it says about itself. 14.5%, just like the other one. Wow, that's hefty. That'll, that'll get it, get you going. Um, black cherry, plum, hint of spice, wild berry. Okay, supple, round tannins. Mmm, I'm not getting the suppleness, but tannins are definitely there. All in all, I think I give this wine, give this wine two, two doges, two doges. Decent. Not, nothing outstanding. If you're in a pinch, go in the grocery store and all you see is Kendall Jackson, you could do worse. You could do worse. All right, that's it for today's episode. I'll see you next time on The Wine Guy. Blame me. Blame me.